Hi. This video is the uh, no, no, bar pattern. Uh, very advanced pattern uh, and mostly on the right side and it's going to affect the left side as well. Um, she has pretty nice thick hair um, but since it's such an advanced pattern and it affect quite a bit of the donor area on the right side. Um, we're probably limited to around 2,000 grafts we can harvest per day. Uh, but the most important is her safety so we got to get as much as we could without jeopardizing um, her uh, scalp. Uh, with this one, you probably need two surgery, um, but the first one we're trying to estimate around 2,000 graph, and uh, the second one probably need another 1,000 to have better density. Uh, but even with one surgery, it should look really uh, good with better um, better density than what it is right now. And after that, you can wear your hair quite a bit of different style. Um, you know, uh, you have to have a genetic pattern hair loss to get... Uh, uh, this type of hair loss pattern and then of course braiding uh, worsen it but you notice that not every um, black girl or black woman who braid their hair lose their hair only some and, and then the braiding um, only those who has in a, well, those who have what they call um, genetic pattern hair loss inheritance and then once you braid then you have further hair loss uh, for this client uh, is uh, 2,000 at least to begin with and because the limitation is how many graphs I can pull out per day um, considering that the donor area is being affected on part of it. Um, but if she's patient with me I can get her there and give her a better density and the result going to be fantastic. Uh, just going to be one year follow-up and uh, she's willing to do another year follow-up for us to film this. Uh, hair transplant is not just the surgical skill of the surgeon. It requires a lot of the artistic and aesthetic detail as well. Um, but you got to find the surgeon or the clinic who specialized on, on black curly hair, and you had to do it multiple, uh, you know, multiple, multiple surgery, um, and then you get really good at it. And most way to find out is just go on YouTube and type of hair black woman hair transplant before and after photos by Dr. Deep. And you see, or you can go to my website at www.mhtaclinic.com or call 1-866-999-6482 so you can see a lot of the before and after on black women and black men and that's my specialty. So once we get the shape down, we don't want, we don't change we don't want to change who's the client is. We follow her natural hair pattern and after that <coughs> uh, so that way we won't change her her type of hairline and then we were trying to fill in as much as we could and so then allow her to style her hair the number one goal is always this and number two is down here and we don't want to go down too low because the neck hair is never permanent and again it just depends on how much hair we have but again of course most important this part first um, as we get older the neck hair you start losing it either way so uh, we would rather put it in the most uh, important area is this area as well uh, so we're going to do another year follow-up for her and this is the art of hair transplant restoration surgery on a black woman with uh, advanced hair loss pattern inheritance and uh, worsened by and accelerated the hair loss by uh, braiding. Thank you.